when the opportunity opened up, it, it was just it was the right time. It was a great opportunity. Uh, you know, there's there's a saying in the Lower Valley, right? Lower Lower Valley guys never kids never die, and and this being also a Lower Valley school, also. Um, it, it really, really attracted me. Uh, I think as an educator, I think we are we're put in a position to motivate and inspire as many kids as we possibly can. So my message to our Riverside kids was, it, it was the honest truth that uh, it was it was it was time to just time to move on, kind of deal. And uh, the inspiration just came. It, change was good. Change was good, and it was time to to move. But uh, I'm excited. I'm I'm happy with the body of work that we did at Riverside. I'm, I'm excited for those kids and, and that program. They're going to continue to do what they do, but it, it's time for another challenge. And I, I'm excited here about the Bel Air uh, uh, football program and the community here and the athletic programs. I, I just want to continue to add to the success that they already have going on and let's elevate it. You know, the, the goal is uh, to get to December in football and let's let's play through Thanksgiving and, you know, win area championships and things of that nature. So uh, it's, it's time to put a, a different brand a different mark of football uh, that that we know how we we believe we have a blueprint. We have a blueprint to uh, to, to to turn a program around, sustain it, and elevate it. You talked about how you're gonna have a meeting with the kids at 4:30. What is your message gonna be to them? You know. Um, it's the, the message is simple it's 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 rolling up our sleeves and let's go to work expectations will always be high expectations are high and and you know we we lost a day yesterday so summer workouts for everybody started yesterday and so summer workouts start for us today and and the expectation is high i mean i i believe if what you do you want to be the best so we want to be the best we want to be the district champion we want to be the by district champion and, and that is going to be the message to the guys right now at 4 30 and and we're ready to let's just ready to work yeah, Coach, you called Bel Air a sleeping giant in your speech earlier. Just what was it that drew you here about Bel Air? You know, I, I um, well, one, we, we got a beautiful brand new complex, a beautiful brand new school, and, and I, I believe that this is a place that, that, that can attract a lot of kids, a lot of kids in our neighborhood kids, and, and, and you know, I, I believe that the, expect, the, the level of expectation is, is high, and it still needs to get where it needs to be, and, and, and I believe... I believe we can do that. How difficult was that, that decision to make? I mean, you live Riverside, your alma mater, the ties that you had to that community. Just the decision, how, how difficult was it for you? It was very, very difficult, very difficult. As people know, I'm, a, I'm alumni from there, and I graduated from there, and, and I love those kids, and, and our, our principal there is, is, is a great guy, and, and the administration there is a great guy. So it, it, great people is... It was very hard. It was not. It was not something simple. But, but in our coach, small coaching fraternity, if you will, um, you know, I, I've been wanting to move up in classification. There's, there's no secret about that. There's no secret about that. So I've been, I've been wanting to move up in classification as a, as a, as a football coach. I, and, and I, I thought, I believe that Bel Air was the best fit, and, and, and here we are. So, you know, and, and that was a message that was told to my boys. I, I did, I did talk to our Riverside kids, and I let them know that. So when you ask me about the level of difficulty in that decision is very hard. It's very hard. A lot of, a lot of wife talks for sure. So you mentioned the classification. Just how excited are you to be part of that class? You know, the the Valle teams of the world in that district. Just your excitement. Um, well, the, well, the the district, the district is you know it's it's America's El Dorado and, and Parkland and ourselves. So um, that's a challenge in itself. So I'll, I'll take a challenge and, and you know I, I like to bet on myself and and, and that's what. The boys are going to understand the expectations, and we feel that district titles will run through us. How difficult is it to take over a new program when the season starts in about two and a half months? Well, the time the timeline is 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 not the ideal, right? If you will, but but you know we knew that the minute we hit submit on the on the application, man. So it's it's really not. It's it's you know it's. You know, we got systems that, that we feel we're very confident in and as far as offensively and defensively and strength and conditioning programs, things of that nature. So, you know, as once once the boys are introduced to the new systems, because there will be new systems, um, we're pretty confident. We'll be fine.